right, welcome back. We have Emmett. After your win, you get the chance to speak your mind. Maybe say something nice about the Allen Cup. I like how you keep <laughs> mentioning that I won. Thank you for that. Still call me the champ. Despite what I said about the <laughs> Stanley Cup being better than the Allen Cup, I will sound off on this great tournament that we've had here. Yep. The city's gone all out on it. They've got the beer tents out there. They've got uh, a little Hockey Hall of Fame sort of thing up in the Civic Center. Great coverage that you guys are providing on Twitter. Mentioning you should follow these guys. <laughs> as well, you know, just the community's come out with great support. The game last night was rocking, so yeah. it's looking good for Lloydminster. And I'm going to share some love with you, too, as well. Uh, give out your Twitter handle. Newcap TV Matt C. There you go. Yeah. Moses W. Newcap. Works out great. Follow. Yeah, Rotate follow 100. us. We'll uh, <laughs> definitely provide you the coverage for the whole tournament. That's great. Well, we still got a bit of time for one more topic. Uh, let's talk about Bobby Valentine. Well, interesting guy, to say the least. Yeah, he questioned his third baseman, Kevin Euclid, publicly on TV, and then all of a sudden, the rest of the team started backing up Kevin Euclid. <laughs> now, it's kind of a bit of a backlash. Is this something that, I don't know if it's intentional or not, but has he already lost, and by he, I mean Valentine, lost the dressing room already after, what, 10 games? I think he was going to lose it anyways. I mean, the Red Sox are a type of team. It's just like the players, just, they kind of stick together. Coaches and whoever can kind of whatever you can show us what to do but we're not really going to listen because we're the boston red sox um but at the same time you shouldn't really call it your third baseman one of the best hitters in the league well we've seen that Seven coaching strategy in. time and time again in every sport calling out their star who's slumping a bit but usually but it's seven from games a, in yeah that's usually a <laughs> but, guy who's but he been called, in the dressing yeah, room but, for but a while yeah and, but he's called into question his commitment to the team and I think that's where it kind of drew the line. We're like, all right, if the guy's slumping or whatever, we can understand that. But I think it was a big issue was the fact that he kind of went after him in a public manner, not privately or to the team, but he went out publicly and did this. And I think that was the, the bigger concern. Now, the thing is, that, like you say, it's an old boys club. They don't care who it is. No. Terry Fancluna kind of lost the room, and he lost his job because of it. And you look what they did last year, having a nine-game lead or so in September. They lost it. But... Is it fair to say that after just 10 games, Valentine is going to be done in Boston pretty soon? Or? Well, how do you question a guy's commitment after a week and a half of playing? Yeah. You have 162 games and you're doing that. Uh, I could see Valentine probably this one and only year. Like, <laughs> his hair is so gray. It's just going to be even <laughs> gray. I noticed that on the weekend. <laughs> Holy cow, is he gray. <laughs> well, that's what kind of happens with the, uh, well, I guess with all the stress, and it's been a week and a half. I guess. No play for <laughs> Mr. Gray. I guess the Just for Men's not working for him. So. That, he'll be a great spokesperson after this, I guess. Yeah, you got to, I mean, I trust the players on that one. They know the player better. They've been around much longer. Yeah. Well, is that a team that should be blown up then? Well, actually, you no, know what? No. Really quick, yes or no? No. Uh, no. No? All right. Well, on that note, uh, we're going to be done here for this week. Thank you for joining us. Tune in next weekend and cheer on the Border Kings as they take on a chance to, for the Allen Cup in Stony Plain. Take care.